Yes, yes, asanteni sana. Thank you so much for joining me live. Asanteni sana nyinyi kwa kuja jipigieni makofi one more time. Karibuni sana. We are coming live from Ibru TV, Upper Lovington, and I'll be your host, Chipukizi. And uh, first of all, I have to apologize. Last week, I was not able to, to do the show because of Zaitangwa uh, Itilafu Zakimwili. I was sick. I was not feeling well. For the first time, Nilienda Hospital in Kambiwa Daktari, Nikona Fatigue. 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 Mimi. Fatigue. Fatigue. Mimi. Nilipigia mamangu ni kome, mam, si, ni kona fatigue. Iyo nengani. But uh, we thank God we are back. We have an amazing show today. We'll be having a DJ Afro. Mnajua right kabisa. Yeah. <laughs> we'll be in the building. I'll also be talking to, um, to a very young girl. She's a blogger. She blogs about a very interesting topic. She blogs about... Um, <coughs> Intercourse. She blogs about um, <laughs> erotic. She's an erotic blogger. Let me just say that. And also, kutoka Dar es Salaam to Konae, kio akidangani ma. Yeah, you come down here, you know. Amisa Mobeto, kutoka Dar es Salaam, da kuwa ndani ya nyumba. But before that, before that, I think uh, there is something that I really want to talk about. Muna juu, kwa wale na patana na nini yuko njia muna niita director. Kazi yangu inakuanga ni kujadiliana na madawa ya kulevi. Na juzi nimeona mbunge wa kibira, kibra, uh, bona okoth, hameenda kusponsor bill ambayo inasema, to legalize bangi. Sasa hapo zaza ndiyo zaza ni kama tulanza kukwaruzana sasa. Because ya yu ni sekta yangu. Si ati bangi ni sekta yangu, kuili, kuikontrol ni sekta yangu. <laughs> but you know, it's, it's a conversation that I, first of all, before we say anything, how muku hapa, what do you think? Bangi to legalize ama tuwachane na? Si waski? Ha? Goja DJ, ha? Okay, let's do vile walifanya parliament. Mm. Let's do vile walifanya parliament. Those of a similar opinion, we legalize with the eye. Aye. And those of the other opinions say nay. The nays have it. <laughs> Even the militias were just here for parliament. But, but listen, guys, listen. I think the conversation of legalizing weed is a conversation that we need to have while we are sober. To see on game, we are going to legalize bangi, come out to corner bangi. What are the bangi, you can get a jury bangi. Now, you know, you're going to make one and she kiss you. Who are called Conino Gangi parliament? Conino called on gay parliament. Come, come on, go that I pick up here and get on the gear. But you see, I've seen people, it's not like we don't know that marijuana has medicinal value. If we know. It's not like we don't know that marijuana can bring revenue to the country. But you see, mimi nilikuwa nime kasitika sana juzi by the way, kwa sababu, ukianza kuambia watu wa legalize weed, uende parliament, kama MP, utebo bill, uanze kusponsor. Mimi unani at break, kwa sababu, nime kuwa nikikuwa kwa country, nikiambia watu wa stay sober. You see, and you will agree with me, the, 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 the problem of alcohol and drug abuse in the country, ni mbaya. Watu wanakufa. Watu wanakuwa wanda wazimu. Bangi inaharibu watu. Angalia rikomondi kitu inamfanyikia. <laughs> Nimetaja akothe hapa kwa isuwa mimi. So, I feel like there are some parts of his bill that I agree with by the way. For real, there are some parts of the bill that uh, uh, Okothe is tabling that we, that neza, that neza ziongelea. Unajua? Kitu kama mtu wakishikwa kivuta bangi, asie kwenda anisi, ndiyo? Wacha kunichezea wimbo ya bangi wewe. Lakini yongo mabia simba. <laughs> wacha ujinga wewe. Wacha ujinga wewe. Kulo. Kulo. But on a serious note, I, I'm not in a position where I can say we legalize or not. But at the same time, lazima to see a We sit down, we talk. I'm ready to go sit down with the court. Nakada is open. We will go and discuss. But as a country, I don't think that we are ready for it. You know why? Because we already have alcohol that's already uh, legalized and it's been controlled. Na tunaipata inaingia kwa mashule zetu. Sindio, si watoto wanakunywa pombe. 12 to 18 year old kills. Sasa unataka kuniambia hii bangi na itakuwa ya 10 bob watu wa nasari wataivuta. 
you know, so let's think sober. Let's have the conversation while we are sober. We table all the ideas, all the views to Sikilizane. Bangi siya ti, bangi pia ni mekwaruzana na yo marambili yama moja. Siya ti kufuta, ni meni pita mbali na moshi. Lakini unawana, hii ni bangi hii. Unawana hapa uwe rikomondi. Hii ni bangi. Kabisa, kuna kitu ingine na kuna muuma hapa. Lakini hapa na hii bangi hii ni wanda wazimu hii. He's a crazy person. Yeah, but you know, I, I also went ahead to invite a guy. There's a guy here who wants to, that's why I've said that we need to listen to everybody. There's a guy here that I want to give a chance. Atuambia ya mauni yake ya bangi ni gani. I met him today. He said that alikuwa meni kasirikia sana. Sifanyi kazi ya njini lipewa ni fanya. So ladies and gentlemen, introducing Balo. Akizungumzia mambo ya Balo. Karibu Balo. Karibu Balo. Karibu, karibu. Bwana chipukizi unajua ni mesika nare sana. Sishike nare ndugi yangu. Karibu sana. Ah, ni mejam. Karibu. Unataka chai, maji? Ah, ah no. I need nothing. Maziwa? I already have everything. Maziwa? Chipukizi, let me ask you one question. You can have a seat, my no, no, I can have it later on after we discuss this issue ya bangi. Chipukizi, wacha ni kuulize. You have made your 20 billion ceilings the previous week. You have it in your pocket. <laughs> what now do you do with it? Bangi is illegal. Kongo pia mutudo ni kondani. Vince, chipukizi pia juzi tumekupatia director. Musima, yani, badala ya kutetea my youth, interest the youth, where you are busy here. Chipukizi, do you know we are watching you? The country is watching. We did not just appoint you to this office to come and you go against our will. My brother, I'm not very happy with you. In fact, I've been seated there thinking, are so, you there to abuse us or to talk about issues? Kama vile niluliza tukianza, unataka maziwa? Wanainchi watukufu unataka maziwa ama yendi anataka maziwa? So boss, let me ask you, on a serious note though, do you smoke weed? Yes. <laughs> you smoke weed? Evident. Evidently. Police wanaona hii kipindi. Usisaa uchome sana. Okay. Okoth is my friend. When he's talking, he's talking about something that he knows very well. So you want us to legalize weed? Yes, that is, it is long overdue. <laughs> long overdue. But why should we legalize weed? Because Okoth oh, said that it's because weed has medicinal values, it has a treat, it has a fanya mambo mingi. Wewe unataka kwa nini? Mi nataka hii weed ikuwe legalized kwa sababu part, mimi kama mimi wenye na etomea kama psych up ya system. <laughs> Watu wengine wana etomea kama ya kuongeza kama tuseme Biasara. Do you know how many people wale wameenda sule kuwa sababu ya hii bangi wenyi we ukubisi hapa unapingana na mambo yake? Watu wamezoma juu ya bangi? Bangi. Wewe umeenda sule wewe? I tried a bit. At least I tried. Okoth. Okoth. This is a problem that you're trying to create in the country, my friend. We need to factor in this in your, in your bill. Yeah, Mr. Koth, we are here, we are supporting the bill. <laughs> and we are going to collect signature, Mr. Koth. Don't worry about him. Buona director. Don't say me in front of the country. The country are watching you. The youth are waiting on you, my brother. Why is it that now you are being... So you want me to go in, in that board of Nakada and endorse legalization? Yeah, like, me? okay. The truth of the matter is that... Uh, let us not call it bangi. You know, that is, the, that is the problem. The name itself was, the name was given by people who hated it. Do you know the name that we call it today? Who knows the name, my friends? You tell us this story, Niyako Ndukiangu. Omera kabu ile tangu tukiwa suguletu likuwa tunaita sensemina. Jina tamu. Sensemina, hata we ukisikia sensemina na jina bangi. Afadhali hata weed. But you bangi, 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 bangi. <laughs> what is bangi? What walipatia jina bangi ni the people who hated it. So how long have you used it? Uh, now this is the 40th year. Fourth mm. year? 40th. Kwani, how old are you? I'm 56. Na unakuja hapa kuniambia weni youth? 
And now, now it is even more clearer than Bangi does not do any harm. If Balubalu has been votaring for the last uh, 40 years, <laughs> and I am still sober <laughs> enough to come to Chipukizi show, what do you think? Chipukiza, I want you to get on record, because you are the youngest in that board, that Sisi Kamaki na Balubalu, we placed you there. And we placed you there, <laughs> basically, to have our interest taken care of. And here you are. Omera, you need to go get Pachwa. Okoth is trying to talk his language, and you are even going behind Okoth. <laughs> <laughs> you know, even who, who, who is in the affair. Is this what you know, you? today, Leon, what, <laughs> let me tell you, Gunaswali na ulizango wa kila mali ni kienda interview. Ulingiaji kwa bodi ya nakada. Kumbe ni yawa wali nieka hapa. Thank you so much, bro. I've heard you. Yes. We are going to listen to everybody. Yes. We will talk with the court. Yes. But I promise you one thing. One thing that I promise everybody. Na wale wengine wakona kama huyu. Hakuna bangi to legalize. Okay. Substance abuse is very harmful, my Whether friend. Whether it's illegal or legal. Mm. You know what is happening around. <laughs> kama wendi yo director na umesema muna guwarusanaga mahali. Mm. Watu wanakula bangi bwana. <laughs> Sawa. Watu wanakula bangi bwana. Asante bwana. Asante sana. Asante baba. Asante sana. Wa, wakule wasikule. Wakule wasikule. <laughs> Sasa wale polisi ambao labda mnatizama hii kipindi yangu ningependa niwaambie kwamba mkishika watu kama hao huko nje msipeleke jela ni leteni. <laughs> Kuna haja tupeleke hawa watu polisi. There is a place that we can take them. But here is the thing. My point in all this conversation about legalizing weed is that let's talk, let's have a conversation, but uh, let's also be, 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 you know, let's also talk about the, the effects that we have in our country right now. Because it's a substance and it can be abused. Substance, drug, and it can be abused. And also in our country right now, we have been affected. Watu wanakufa kila siku kwa sababu ya drugs. Na unaanzanga tuna bangi, unaenda kwa cocaine, unaenda kwa heroin, you find yourself in a situation that you can't pull out yourself. Sindio? Mm. Anyway, uh, enough about bangi. Tuweke bangi kando. Tuweke bangi kando. We need to talk to some serious people. Though. The lady that I want to call on stage right now is a very young girl. Um, she is a blogger. She blogs about a very sensitive topic. I don't know kama Masaya Ezekiel Mutua imepita. But ladies and gentlemen, introducing the youngest erotic blogger in 254, uh, Roberta Bobby. Wapi makofi yake? Kabire. Sasa msupa. Kwa Sorry, sorry, sorry. 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 Why ni mfuti? Karibu sana. Thank you. Karibu sana. Hi. Hi. Ude mame jina kuniambia ni meambo usikuwe mmini kwa angu. Mikuwa ni miu kwa mmini? Sindio, uu... Let's have a conversation. Mambo lakini. Poa sana. Lakini mtu kama wewe na hizo vitu unaandikanga lazima uko na confidence. Uwezi uwezi niogopa mimi. So how are you? I'm very fine. Your mom is watching? Eh hey, mom dad everyone. Hey, hey mom dad. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Tuko hapa leo. Eh uh, so how old are you? I'm 22. 22. Yeah. You're in school? Yeah. I'm studying? I'm I'm done. I'm graduating. This year? Yeah. Eh, yeah. Mugok blog since when? Uh, for the last three years. This is my third year. Three? Yeah. You learned to blog when you were 19? Yes. First of all, let's, wait, wait, wait. Let's establish what you blog about. You blog about? I blog about relationships, sex, um, mm -hmm. and everything to do with that. Everything around HIV, relationships, sex, consequences of sex. So, like, yeah. like, like, what consequences so far have you... <laughs> Una try kusema nini uliza tu uliza tu So far consequences that you may highlight so far ni kama gani Um mostly in my blog mm -hmm. mostly uh HIV mm -hmm. STDs mm -hmm. things like that because mm -hmm. it's one of the most the biggest consequences of mm -hmm. se sex and sizing people are not really having safe sex mm -hmm. so that's what I try to gear towards So you try and tell yeah. people to to place Mwambia watu Sex ni poa. Yeah. Na napiganga stories of sex. I don't shy away from saying what sex is. You mentioned tu mara moja because mom, dad, wana, wana watch. Azi, so. azi. So many, so many kazi yangu. Yeah. <laughs> Wacha tuitafutia jina ingine. Wacha tuita sukuma. 
Because of Ezekiel. No, kibui. Tuita kibui. So, I hear kibui and then, in Nipoa. <laughs> but wase wacheze safe. Wase wakwe safe. Okay. Drew, enyewe, ni crazy. Hmm. Saizi wase wana. Neza, say, neza tumia wazi. Kibuyu. Saizi wase wana kibuyu yana crazy. Yeah. So, <laughs> it's working, it's working. It's working. Okay. Bora, bora melewa. Okay. And we need to know that we need to be safe. Okay. We need to be... Kwanza saizi, venye statistics za HIV zina increase. Okay. Ni mwana umwana hizo... Yes, I saw them. I saw them. I saw them. And I, and I get your point. And that's yeah. a very good thing, by the way. Yeah. The, the only thing that now makes me wonder is that you started blogging while you are 19. Yes. W what was the drive? Uh, ni kianza kuandika. I wasn't mm. really writing about atisex. Mm. Na kibuyu. Kibuyu. Ya, ku, kibuyu <laughs> yana, sorry. Mm -hmm. Uh, I was writing about relationships. Mm -hmm. I would just talk about the things I was doing mm -hmm. uh, in my relationships, mm -hmm. uh, the things I would go through, mm -hmm. Okay. Then um, it was a way for me to vent. So as a 19-year-old, the things you were going through? Yes. 19 years old. How old were you? Me at a Zijaanza one. 19, you are going through stuff. Hmm? Hmm? Yeah, but it's just... Because I, I really want to understand. You yeah. are 19. Yeah. What What do you know about relationship? Kwanza hizi pictures angu mlito wa wapi? Tu ni Google. Google. Hizi uliko unapige una post. That's why you're told Google never forgets. Wow. Ni za kitambo. But so, you see, yeah. it, it's one thing that I like about, and the reason why I called you on my show is because it's a very good thing that you're young yeah. and you're ready to come out and, you know, talk about uh, Kibuyu and educate young people on, you know, having it and having it safe. But wait, are we not saying that the actual word because of, of the time the show airs? Because of the time. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, sour. Because yeah, you see, it's a topic people don't want to talk about. That's true, even at home. Yeah, people don't say... People don't want to out outrightly just be able to have conversations. Yes. And I normally say that I'm actually lucky. I come from a liberal family where mm -hmm. Madangu, Budangu, we talk. Mm -hmm. They tell me this. The Sataniki drum, they've said it. They know they've told me this is right, this is wrong. Mm -hmm. If you want to talk about anything, come to me. You see, so mm -hmm. me wants your home. That's mm -hmm. why I think it, I was able to be open now with the whole world to tell people this is what I do. This is what happens. But now you see, this let is me how stop it you. feels. But that also, yeah. that also should come as a disadvantage because you see now some youths, mutu as I to me, come excuse. Yeah. You know when you're that open and liberal with your parents, you say, yeah. "Ata mangu," you get. No, no. I think um, I feel like when you have parents who are a bit open-minded, because in Africa, it's taboo. But when you're in a setting where you're allowed, you become careful, you become responsible. Mm -hmm. It's like I, I put this bowl of fruits here. Ni kwambia easy, mneza kula. You utaboeka sasa, ko ziko, haunyimwi. But if I take it and I put it somewhere and I tell you, don't touch them. Don't, and I don't tell you why I don't want you to touch them. Utakuwa curious, utataka kudra, mbono unafitra, mbono utaki kuniambia, wacha ni try ni jione, you see? Yeah. And that's where People are exploring, people are going out and doing all these things. And mm -hmm. sister, that's where the consequences come in. Mm -hmm. And then the same, the same parents and, or rather, the generation before me and before before, they don't want to even be able to say, uh, there's STDs, there's HIV, there's mm -hmm. pregnancy, mm -hmm. there's all these things. Mm -hmm. And it's not that if it happens to you, at it's the end of the world. Mm -hmm. But some things, if we can, we should prevent. Okay. You get. So that's what I mean, basically. Okay. Yeah. So which which generation are you advising? Yako um, um from the from the demographics of my blog, mm -hmm. I'd say I talk to people who are from as young as even twelve. Twelve. To to no, to, 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 to. no no, I'm saying mm. people as young as twelve are having sex right now. People as young as nine years old are having sex. Nine. Kibuyu, kibuyu na ribu. Are having kibuyu. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Mm -hmm. So you see, they're going to stumble upon my work on the internet or mm -hmm. on what to refer to what to do with my work. But your blog, yeah. how many people read? Like, uh, well, like the last time that many people read your blog, how many people? The, the last time the 
like what do you mean the like, last article i wrote no no, no. The, the, the article you see funny because almost sana the best like the best uh almost 100k views how many almost 100k views 100k views yeah and do do you make money out of yes i do i make money from adverts mm -hmm. uh paid sponsorships adver mm -hmm. mostly that mm -hmm. yeah okay that's how i make money from the blog see um when I started writing, I wasn't even looking to make money because mm. it was just a way for me to vent and to just say what I was feeling, what I was going through. Mm. But Nikanza Kukwa approached na organizations, say even condom companies, mm -hmm. uh, organizations that work with HIV patients and mm -hmm. stuff like that. Mm -hmm. They want me to create awareness, to talk about all these things. So, mm -hmm. in as much as Nambia Watu, Kibuyuni poa. Mm -hmm. no. Kibuyuni, Kibuyuni, yeah. now I a story, steamy, 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 but I don't know. Kwa hawa 12, I hope na wambia nga si poa. Exactly. Hawa to hii lazima na hawa lazima wambia Kibuyu bado, si poa. Kibuyu is dangerous, it will kill you, you will die today. We can chop you. But... No, kwa? See, I think I could mention that you need to be safe because it's a lost cause. It's a like stick or honest, completely honest. Because okay. yeah, everything when you do everything in excess, there's 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 the harmful side. Kuna addiction, kuna ya 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 and I don't know. You gonna be you need movie a vibo you same vibo you same zina. But ata kuna. Vibo you same zina zina zina. So let me ask you. Yeah. What 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 do you think about gay and lesbianism rights in in our country? Una drama ni msem liberal. Mhm. Mimi I don't judge people. Mhm. I feel like if it's okay for you, if it's what you really want, and you're not affecting anyone else. Mhm. How affect Nibako, how infringe on anyone's rights, it's what you really feel. I think you should be <laughs> yourself. Manda, <laughs> myself, what do you think? Lesbianism. Okay, only the question be straight back. I'm a lesbian now, I'm a gay. Eh. What do you think? It's, are we ready as a society, as Africa, as Kenya? As Africa, I don't think we are ready. Mm -hmm. As Roberta, I'm okay with it. You're okay with it? Yeah. I'm okay with people just sharing love and loving each other and so you know but it's kiss why why it's just an example it's an example but you're an example by what you're doing in a poor uh nani 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 oh man nani oh man i recall justin bieber but that's not african so it's a touch home it won't really touch home. <laughs> um, I feel like we're not ready to accept that as a culture. Vitu mm mob -hmm. Africa ni taboo. Africa vitu mob to accept and to kianza ku adapt it akanika we are becoming westernized mm -hmm. and nika we are rushing too fast. Mm -hmm. But honestly, I'm a very open-minded person. Okay. I don't really, I don't necessarily have to be gay or mm -hmm. a lesbian or whatever. Mm -hmm. But I feel like um, just let people be. Okay. Just let, kama haikuhus, kama haikusumbui, why are you bothered? Okay. You know? Yeah. And as long as they're safe, that I just feel like, yeah, just let people do what they want to do. So, so, butita wai wai, like you've had? <laughs> if you feel like, so, bro, uneza uma? Uneza kibuyu. Uneza kibuyu. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, but, uh, Lakini wacha ni ongeza example ingine juu watu watafikiria wae wae na butita wana date. Meja timidat. Red sun. Na producer. Soja. Red sun. But anyway, thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having me. Before you go, I think it's only fair. There are so many young people who are home. Yeah. Uh, they finish campus probably. They 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 into drugs. Yeah. They they you know what 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 can you tell them? Um, it's really important to stay in school. Yeah. It's really important to know what you want to do with your life, but it doesn't come immediately. Just give yourself time. Um, just life is short. Jibambe, but just know what you want to do with. Cause me siku somia kibuyu. Yeah. You know, 
but and that's it's not how, something that you want to do. But that's how I'm making money. Yeah, you true. get. Yeah, and yeah. it's something that has given me so many opportunities and I never in my life thought I'd ever become a blogger. Yeah. I don't I never even used to write, you yeah. know. Yeah. So um in as much as you're going to school, just find just know what you really want to do with yourself. Okay. Story of drugs, I wouldn't really advise guys to overindulge, mm -hmm. but Bangi. Bangi. Sengeja bangi. Bangi to legalize ama tuache nae. I'm just asking, I want to get people's opinion. Um Ukipia yeye mtu anajipata mengi hiyo side nyingine ya kibuyi. Umesikia yule anakuwa na utanga kama psychop. Ako tu sawa. So what do you think? Unajua madango na wachista. Okay, so ma'am, uh, <laughs> it's okay. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having me. And uh, wish you all the best. Your blog is called uh, Bobby Bomb. Um, on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, everywhere. Snapchat, kila kitu, Robata Bobby, R O B E R T T A B O B B I E. Robata Bobby. Robata Bobby? Yes. So, what we are coming there, and you appear bundles in Inoma. It's okay. And the blog itself is called. Uh, it's called Bobby Bomb. If you just Bobby. search on Google, it'll come up. Bobby Bomb. Yeah. Santi Santi. Thank, Thank you so you. much for coming. Santi Santi. I'm going to get my coffee at Kiondo Katakivali. But it's your son. Santi Santi. Mm. So, so, guys, I think it's only fair. When we come back, we're going to be talking to DJ Afro and Amisa. I'm asking you what when you band. Skilly up. We're going to take a short break. We'll be right back after the break. Right back. I'm going to open up my phone. Yes. And we are back. And we are back. Thank you so much, by the way, ma'am. I know you are watching. Asante sana, mami. Mwishmua jagwa. Karibu sana mwishmua mzee mudiambo. Thank you so much for watching. Babu wa wino, tibim. Anapiga simu sana. Anani ya tavuta nini? Ndraga kujenga constituents in Tanzania. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, the lady that I'm about to introduce on stage is a very beautiful young lady. She's a musician, a CEO, a business lady. Um, all the way from Tanzania. I met her today for the first time. She's an amazing person, ladies and gentlemen. Wapi makofi shangwe vigelegele. Za Amisa Mobeto Tokadara. Mbamisa wa Mobeto Tokadara. Karibu sana, mama. Hi. Karibu sana. Mbamre fu. 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 Pulo. Pulo, pulo, pulo. Karibu sana. Asante. You can have a seat. Mm -hmm. One more time. Uh, Songea uko mama. Oh. Kimila cha sisi wa oh, Kenya. That's your side? Yeah, this is my side. Why? Yeah, for the security. Just in case anything happens. Oh. Red sun and I can give up how to water my brain. <laughs> <laughs> ah, karibu sana Nairobi. Asisa mba natameza inata water. What if I'm thirsty? Uwe ni mchoyo. Pole sana. Huku ni Nairobi ya uta anza kutoletea maneno sana ire Tanzania hapa. Now, listen. Kuna chai hapa. Makunyonga chai? No, I want water. But it's okay. I will have it later. Okay. Tafadhali. Ma directors, please. Nisaidieni. Nisaidieni na maji. But karibu sana. This is your first time in Kenya or second? Like a thousand. I've always, I'm always here for some reason, yeah. My best friend lives here. Mm -hmm. Shout out to QP. And I have my, my other friends, Akina like, Amina Amaru, mm -hmm. Akina like, Asma, Yoko, and everybody else. So, okay. yeah, I feel like it's my second home. So before we even get to the interview, uh -huh. I've, I've always wanted to ask you. Katia, how are you Okay. You are a man. You are a Yupi. Chui na Simba. Chui. <laughs> Wapenda chui. Yeah. Aya. Ah, Umezaliwa Tanzania wapi? Um, Mwanza. Mwanza. Yes, lakini kabira langu ni Mnyamwezi. Um, Wanyamwezi are they are from Tabora. Okay. Yeah. Mnyamwezi ni kama hao na kama ni Wakamba eh? I don't know. <laughs> so you went to school? Yeah, and born and raised in Dar es Salaam. Yeah, and I went to school in Dar es Salaam. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ukamaliza? Ni kamaliza. Then after finishing school, mm -hmm. ndo nikaingia kwenye urembo na wana mitindo. Yeah. 
wana mitindo. So how yeah. how did it happen? How how did it all happen? How did you find yourself here? Um, for some reason, I never, I didn't have a dream to become a model. Mm -hmm. I've always wanted to be a singer. Like when I was in school, I wanted to become a musician. Okay. But then when I finished school, because of my hate and you know my the way I work. Mm -hmm. So people kept on approaching me, approaching me like you should do, you should do modeling, you should do beauty pageants and everything. So yeah, I ended I ended up doing that, and then I also did what I also from from the modeling I also did acting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and here I am. So I I felt like this is the right moment for me to start doing what I've always wanted to do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mwendo na shape. Kio akidangani. Uh-huh. Modeling. Mm -hmm. That was your first song. No, no, so it was not my my first song. I mm. did a couple of songs mm. back at home, but I think Salome ndo ili hit. Mm. Yeah, and I think Pia so, kwa mm. sorry. Mm. Just who mwenye kwa hiyo video, who mm. diamond. Yeah. Okay. Mm. <laughs> I'm just checking. Okay. But this is this is where you met no, no, no. Nilikuwa na mjua kitambo. Like, since I was in school, I actually... Ulikuwa na mwona ona tu? No, nilikuwa kama rafiki yangu, kama, yeah, hivyo. Okay. Yeah. Hapa Nairobi, how tunawitanga mafisi? Mafisi. <laughs> Anakuonanga tuwa ujui na takaje, lakini yako tu. Yes, kumonja anakupigia simu ni haje. Mkona video manze, shuka mi. <laughs> but, but, so, that's where you met with Diamond. Um, First of all, do you love this song? I love that song. Um, the reason why I accepted to be on the video is because of the song. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And and uh, so you meet with Diamond there, and then because now, mm. <laughs> I'm trying to be very serious about. Because now you see, it's ni kutoka kwa iwi mbondo tulianza kukuskiya. Kido kuku kabada kuanza kuskiya mara wote na sari ni kama hosti ni kama misa kona mtoto. That's where the whole relationship started. Mm -hmm. I'm listening. Ulianziana na diamond kwa hii wimbo? Kuanziana na hivi sasa. Si relationship. Relationship. No, it was something way back then. I don't want to talk more about it, but mm -hmm. it's something that happened before the song, before the whole before the baby, before the whole. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Na 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 si by back then and, and I want you to understand me. Na mm. nataka tu kujua ni watu wamenitumia maswali mingi sana. Sawa. Wanataka nikuulize. Uh -huh. So hiyo hiyo siku Zari 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 alikuwa herja. Mlikuwa mnajuana naye. Kujuana naye kivipi? Kama wewe na Misa hivi ulikuwa mnajuana na Zari? As in personally. Personally or you had met? No. You had never met. Niko mm. tu muona kwa TV. Akipita pita tu na ngoza white. Something like that. <laughs> Mm -hmm. but, but then, how, how, how relationship yako ilikuwaje? Kwa sababu saizi najua umekosana na diamond. Mm -hmm. Kwa sababu, unajua, kwa sababu kisa najua ni kwa sababu ulimblock ujuzi kwa Instagram. Okay. <laughs> kwa nini? What happened? Um, I don't want to talk much, like more, to get more into details. But I, I felt like it was the right moment for me to move on. The right moment for me to do my own stuff. We already have a baby, so it's not it's not a relationship that I would like to continue. So I had to end it. Why? <laughs> Why? Um, I, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of amazing guys out there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Do, do, just allow me to ask me this question. It's fine. Do, do you feel like Ushai mm. Kosea Zari? Because I have a very bitter. Do you feel like. That's a very tricky question. <laughs> I, I know it's, it's just that sometimes Mushino, because I, sometimes I see her, she's very bitter, she posts. Mm. But probably where mm. mm -hmm. do you feel Ulim um, Kosea? No comment. I'm not going to answer that way. <laughs> <laughs> Samson. Samson. Now, 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 right now, uh, mm -hmm. do, do, just allow me. It's a, you can ask. Do you feel like I'm gonna cook? I'm gonna cook I don't know. It's not like, a, it's not like she's a person that I've met or we have discussed or I've communicated with her in one way or another. Okay. So I don't know. 
Okay. Yeah. Okay. Na kwa sasa hivi vile kwa haka muda kumbako, even uh, pia mimi nime break up mara kwa mara. Mm -hmm. Kwa vile ume kidogo na diamond. Mm. How miss? No. How miss? Si missi. Diamond. Yeah, si missi. Chibude, chibude. Exactly, I don't miss him. Simba. Mm -hmm. Si missi. Wasafi MM, wasafi TV, wasafi karata. Umbwa za wasafi. Hizo zote, how si missi? Haba si diamond. Yeah, sometimes you just have to, sometimes you just have to let past be past. Like, okay. yeah, like you, we don't know, like, uh, there, there might be very, like, better things out there. So why should I let myself be st stuck in one place? I agree. You know the question that I ask myself every mm. time I see you? You are a very beautiful young lady, baby. Thank you. And when I look at you, I ask mm. myself, mm. Amisa, mm -hmm. Nini li kuattract kwa diamond? Ni pesa, ni sura, ni lips. Jupia mi lips si kwa njimbaya. Ni talanta, ni nini. Naangalia. Then naanza kutoa pole pole. Nasema sura, I wish. Muziki, what, what, what really attracted you to that guy? This is the last question about diamond, by the way, I'm, I'm asking. Um, I can't really say what attracted me because when... When me and him knew each other back then, he didn't have the stardom, the fame. He didn't have the fame. <laughs> yeah, he didn't have the cash. He didn't even have the body. Mm. So I don't know. Like I don't know. When we started communicated, and that's when I was I, I was really young. I kind of felt sorry for him, you know, because it was this person with big dreams without support. And I couldn't do anything to help him because I was still in school. But we were, we were not dating. He was just like a, a friend, friend to me. Yeah, so then he... he, he After the dream what? <laughs> it's not even Ali, Ali, Ali Niachi after the, after the dream worked because we never dated. We were just friends. Okay. Yes, and then I... We, we kept on communicating even though when he was still... When he was of already a celebrity, okay. but he was not what I wanted at that moment because okay. I still wanted to have, like, I wanted to have my, my goals achieved. I wanted to have everything that I wanted for myself. And he was a person that was mixed with a lot, with a lot of women in our country at that time. Okay. So it was not something that I wanted. Mm. But then because later... You mm -hmm. <laughs> but, but I get what you mean. Yeah, so then later on, mm -hmm. you meet with a person, you mm -hmm. feel like... You feel like he has changed, or he's ready for something this, and then, mm. yeah, you, you dated it, you date, you you try it, and then it doesn't work out. You say, mm, you know what, this is it. Let me tell you something. I understand why a diamond is here. Ah, I'm going to go to the daily and see you. Ah, chibude. It's okay. But you know, enough about enough about um, whatever uh, Simba. You're you're very big on empowering women and mm -hmm. being a CEO. Mm -hmm. you, have a, you have a company, is it a beauty pageant? No, 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 I have, I have, I have a shareholder to, do you know Donzella? Donzella. Um, she is a Ugandan, she, she, she's the owner of Girl Power, Women Empowerment. Okay. So I'm working with her and I also have, I, ha I also have a foundation. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's about, it's, it's, it started working, but it's not already there, like there where I want it to be. Mm -hmm. So hopefully it will be where I want it to be mm -hmm. in a few months or a year. Mm -hmm. And then I also have my own boutique. I also have, yeah, so I have a lot. You have business. I am. And then now you decided to sing. Yeah, so it's because mm -hmm. now I already have the name. Now, Madam Hero Kitambo, Laba mtuwa singe pay attention. But now I want to pay attention to Madam Hero because I'm entirely in Mishako Hami Samogetu. We'll be playing that song right now. When, when online, social media, mm -hmm. so much hate and so mm -hmm. much love, mm -hmm. how do you balance them? Because pe some people are saying, Wum, Chawi, Muganga. Bees kwa na juwa nina and lea ntini kaingia YouTube leo ni kaangalia na chino. Ni na kupost watu anza kusema uchawi, Muganga. How do you deal with all that negativity? Um, I think the best thing is for you to know yourself. Like, okay. this is not only for me, it's for everybody who is dealing with a lot out there. Like, just lean into to the people that believes in you. Mm -hmm. 
only take the positive st stuff to your heart. Mm -hmm. Like you're only supposed to take the best parts and the, the hurtful, the hateful parts, you just leave them to them. Because that has nothing to do with them. When a person hates you mm -hmm. that you don't even know, mm -hmm. it has nothing to do with you. Agree. It's them. And you cannot do anything to Good. change it. Okay. But then you can focus on the people that you love. You can fo focus on the on the things that makes you happy and not dwell on the negativity. Yeah, people you love, Akina Sisi, Akina Sisi, yeah. that's, that's... But then again, the, the, the accusation, the people mm. who accuse you of such things. For mm. example, how to remember, because I, I listened to a clip mm -hmm. where somebody was saying that I don't know. First of all, is it true? Um, I said it, it's true. It's true, they accused you. Um, it's, it's not even true they accused me. Mm. This is, like, a lot of people don't know. When, when you have a child with a person, you will always wish to, for you and the family of the child to get along for the best of your kid. So this, this is the part whereby the, maybe the family of the, of the father of your child does not get along to you. And you hear they went to, um, in, so in, in, in Muslim tonight, ma sheikh, ma, ma, ma okay. So they went there to try to, I don't know, to, to keep on separating you guys, like to not have a great communications. Mm -hmm. And then a person is there and they heard everything and they come to you and say they heard this and this while they were there. Mm -hmm. So you try, to, you try to be a bigger person and say you call the same person. So you don't know, at that time, you don't know what the future holds because you're doing it for the sake of your kid. Yes. You're doing it because you want the family and your kid to get along, you want peace. So then of course you'll call and say, um, I want, if you can make a dua for me, it's dua. dua. It, it, the, the, dua you're you're, you're a Christian, right? I'm a Catholic. Yeah, you're a Christian, okay. Mm -hmm. So you can go to, to church and pray yes. for marriage, for, yes. for, for good business, no for, for a job. For example, yeah. I know you're single, so I'm just saying. <laughs> So, <laughs> so, so it's the same with us Muslims. We can still call share and we can still pray and we can still do doers. But then people re recorded it and misinterpreted like they, they so got... So it was a misinterpretation. Yes, and then it goes there and, and then everybody was like, um, uchawi, uchawi. But then when you listen to the, to the voice notes, when you listen to the whole thing, mm -hmm. it's actually a woman who is mm. trying to make the better life for her kid mm. to get together. So you're trying to make dua for your kids. Exactly. <laughs> Let's appreciate Amisa. She's mm. very honest. She's very honest. Wow, that's, wow, that's, that's, that's nice. Now, um, there, there's so many things to ask you, Amisa, and to tell you. Uh -huh. there, there's a mtotwa kwa kwanza. Okay. Um, uh, Her name is Fantasy. Fantasy. Yes. Fantasy, uh, tunasikia sana ni, ni mtoto wetu uku Kenya. Tunao wabari kwamba ni mtoto wetu. Fantasy. I mean, I think you're talking about Dylan. Because Dylan do anafana na jagua. Oh, Dylan do anafana? <laughs> no, Dylan ni wapili. Oh, so si firstborn? No. Yo, kitu imeletea mweshmiwa shida uku wewe. <laughs> Mwishmiwa ana starehe kabisi. So, Mwishmiwa Jagwa, uh, uh, he was a musician, mm -hmm. a very good friend of mine. Mm. Ni, muna juwana nae, ni mtoto wake, by the way? So mtoto wake. <laughs> so mtoto wake. Um, because first of all, siya yiku meet Jagwa. Eh. It's so weird, but I have never met him in my life. Kujabarana na mzia mungu. Siya wai kumuona. <laughs> ni mwai gitu kumuona kitambo kwenye, kwenye nyimbo videos. Mm. So just, yeah, that's it. Like in this day, who want to personally? So I don't know. Me, me, me. See you, because I will kiss you. When you, when you have your baby, you mm. see like the, maybe the kid looks like the dad and your mother, or and you. But then everybody else starts saying, oh, this and this and this. But no, I've never even met Jago in my life. Yeah, and I'm mm. deeply sorry if that's actually caused him a lot of issues here because hey, it's Instagram and you have. No, 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 no. Yeah. What you do, because I, I, I think he's watching. Let me just tell him. Moshimo, yo kura zi yako ndugu yangu. Yo kura ni spoiled coat. Spoiled mm -hmm. vote. Wow. And, uh, you know, so mm. how's your relationship right now with WCB? Are you guys talking? We're not talking. Mm. We're not talking. We have nothing to talk about. Are they supporting your music? Do they play your music on their TV? Um, I saw their post. They, they posted when my, my music came out. Mm. Yeah. And 
and and this song, Madam Hero. Yeah. Just play. What's the inspiration behind this? Song? I can talk. <laughs> um. So when I gave birth to my son, Dylan, there's there was a lot of issues going on in my country. I'm pretty sure you guys knew about it back then. Yeah, zilikuwa nyingi sana, zilikuwa mob. So I was sad because you know you're coming. You you you, you just came like from 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 Kuzam Toto and a lot of issues are going on. Mm -hmm. So then I was sad. I was really, really sad at that moment. Mm -hmm. And sana mziki sana. Whether I'm in love, whether I am heartbroken, whether I'm happy, whether I'm sad, I will always connect to some parts um to to some particular song for me to listen to or for me to, for that song to cheer me mm -hmm. at the moment. But I did not find the song that could fit my position or my situation at that time. So I talked to my friend, Phoebe, who helped me write that song. Mm -hmm. So I told him the idea. I told him, I want a song. I want to sing it because I'm the one who is in pain. I'm the one who is going through this. So Phoebe, I gave him some words and he helped me out. The, we write the song. He wrote the song. I went to the studio. I recorded it since last year. Mm -hmm. But then it was a song that made me to to kuendelea kufanya kazi zangu okay. it was a song that kept kept pushing me to yeah to do better to mm -hmm. to continue on, on on doing what i love mm -hmm. na kuendelea kazi zangu na kuendelea na ndoto zangu so it was a song that ilinitia moyo sana in so many ways na nilikuwa sina mpango wa kuitoa nilikuwa nataka kutoa nyimbo but nilitaka kutoa nyimbo nyingine sio hiyo because i felt it was really sad it's so a sad song. I it's saw a, it. Yeah, it's, it's a, a sad, sad song. song. I will even watch the video. We'll yeah. play it. But would you, kuna watu maybe ya ujaisikia, unaweza ukawaimbia kadogo tu? Um, kadogo tu. Nake. Okay. Kadogo tu. Haya bisi. Hapa Kenya tuwaita akapela hapa. Akapela. Hapa. Akapela. Hapa. Hapa. Akapela. Hapa. Hapa. Madam Hero. Come on. I should continue? Yes, yes. Uh, I'm kila niki am kasubui. Napata majaribu mengi na madui Na binadamu wakali kama chui DJ amuka ucheze wimbo Hapa tukila mtu Hapa hapa Mbeiro Hibi tu Ehe Akila niki ya mkasubui Na pata majuribu mengi na madui Na binadamu wakali kama chui Tunaenda kwa wapi? Wapoze nja You know this is like my first time singing yet Yeah Oh yeah So I'm your dancer Wala sisa jali kukujulika na acha ni pambane Nisha chosho na njia ya papanya Tulo, tulo, let's appreciate Amisa 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 kuna vocals, siliyo? Now, kwa hiyo video kuna mutu nimeona This is the last question na uliza about Diamond Anasema chuki la masa last question Nini nakuhu, nye? No, si ya ye Si ya ye And yeah, and then concept ya video yote ilitolewa na my director na ito Ivan Mm -hmm. Shout out to you. So yeah, it has nothing to do with me, but I took I took a lot of in the video. I took a lot of struggles that single mothers, that women wanna go through, could take care of their families. So mm -hmm. I took a lot of parts from everybody's life. Nili actually nili observe, nika ask, then took a shoot video. Unataka kuambia nini wasichana ambao? wadogo wanataka kuingilia mambo huku Kenya tunaita masponsor juu kama Tanzania wako unataka kuambia nini wasichana ambao you know wanataka wataki ku work hard maybe when they because most of you they they follow you guys they look at you guys they see you living the life glamour gari hapa pale ndege okay so this having a sponsor ngo nianze kwanza hivi honey is having a sponsor is not a bad thing however having your own it's the most beautiful thing in the world Waking up in the morning and say, you know what, I feel like I want to go to somewhere and then you pay for it on your own. It's amazing. So you guys should stay in school, study hard, 
work hard, get what you want, because sponsors work, but they will just use you at the moment. And then they will dump you. They will get another person. They will spend on that person. And then meanwhile, hukusoma maybe, huku kufanya kazi mm -hmm. unabaki umebweteka and maisha nakupita unapoteza kila kitu so ukiwa na chako ukiwa na chako ukiwa na chako hata kama sponsor akitaka kukufata kama atataka kupa hichi atakupa kingi zaidi okay. na pia atakuwa hana uwezo ku control ku control kwa sababu una kitu chako wewe mwenyewe okay that's yeah. true and single mothers kwa single mothers um first of all i want to say this sisi tunasema kwamba kila mtoto anakuja na bahati yake kila mm -hmm. mtoto anakuja na riziki yake so no matter what happens usijisikie vibaya mm -hmm. hauwezi kujua huyo mtoto baadaye atakuwa nani hauwezi kujua huyo mtoto atakupa nini mm -hmm. hauwezi kujua huyo mtoto anakuletea bahati gani katika maisha kwa sababu there is no way utapata mtoto alafu Mungu asikufungulie milango yako ya wewe ya kula okay. so shukuru kwa kila kitu lakini pia usikate tamaa fanya unachoweza work on your dreams mm -hmm. and love your babies love your babies Love you, babies. <laughs> so, uh, director, Tsikuski, so I don't know how much time I have. But um, um, any collabo soon with any Kenyan artist? Hmm. I will let that remain a surprise. Red Sun is looking for people to collabo with. <laughs> 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 um, soja. Madam Hero Soja. You can hear Nasana. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having Nashukuru me. Sana. She flew all the way to come to my show, by the way. I'm wishing you all the best. Thank you. And I hope to see you soon. Same here. Asante Siano. Uh, thank you. And, and by the way, if mm. you come on after time to uh, Kenya, because I know you have a vacancy. Director Nakada, nini zimu nipea ZV, nini nini? Thank you so much. Thank you so much guys for watching. Muli maliza nyo sanga. Muli maliza nyo sanga. Dogo tu. Accidentally nukupata. Shabuku jaa, papa.